keep you posted. All right, well, we now turn to seven on your side tonight after a Virginia woman emailed us for help defusing a dental dispute that was keeping her from getting a much needed bridge put in place. Chris Van Cleve drills into this one. These two have the temporaries and this is the root canal that was pulled. It's right there in the x-rays and a gardener's problem teeth. You wouldn't want to even be around me then because uh, I can't handle pain very well. It was pretty painful. They had to go and a bridge needed to be put in. All of the work to get ready to take the impression had been paid for. Plus, I paid $3,030 toward a $3,975 bridge. But Gardner is on disability and lives on a fixed income. Back in February of 2011, she needed to save up the rest of the money. The dental practice, Natural Horizons Wellness Center, said it would finish the work when she could pay the rest of the bill. Gardner admits other dental issues cropped up, costing her thousands, which meant the bridge had to wait. It took Anna two years to save up the $945 she needed to complete the work. But by then, the dentist had left this practice, and there was some disagreement over whether the practice or the dentist had the $3,000 she'd already spent. She was worried she'd have to start all over again. And that's when she called seven on your side. Her dentist declined comment. The practice told us a customer issue is a situation we run into less than 1% of the time. We have always been above board and bent over backward to accommodate this woman. As her newly fixed smile shows, our calls paid off. So now I can chew again. I can eat hard food. Her teeth are fixed for the agreed upon price. I want to thank you very much personally for your efforts because without it, I wouldn't have gotten my bridge. Chris Van Cleve. ABC 7 News. And that does it now for ABC 7 News and Talk.